One of the nice functions that there is also on white fox imaging is uh, volume calculation. Basically, if you are able to isolate any type of window or range of Ansville unit, you can uh, then display it in 3D and you can ask the software to, uh, um, uh, to calculate the volume for you. Uh, there is one application that uh, we can see is for uh, the application of sinus lift. And a sinus lift, you need to uh, have a certain quantity of uh, biomaterial, and it's always nice to know in the forehand which, uh, what is going to be the volume of this biomaterial that you are going to be needed. So uh, here. I must say this is where the function of 3D is quite useful. So um, let's first choose for um, a soft tissue. And, uh, there we can see our patient. And uh, the idea will be in, uh, in the next step or, uh, to, uh, to see first how good is the sinus. So in order to do that I use the trim function. And the trim function then enables me to see inside the sinus. Oh, what's happening here? Uh, well, in fact, as you can maybe see, um, uh, yes, we can see it quite well here. Uh, we have here a patient that is uh, that has a, a, a sinus that is completely full. So, of course, this is also one of the great benefits of, of white fox, in contrary to to a panoramic or what we call OPG. Uh, uh, device is that you get precisely uh, the idea to get soft tissues and that you don't get on a pan panoramic. In a case like that, if you were planning to, to do a, a sinus lift, just imagine that you would uh, discover a, a sinus that is uh, completely full. Uh, the operation is simply cancelled and, and you just uh, waste your time. So, what we're going to do is simply trying to fill up this uh, sinus. And for that, I need to um, define exactly uh, the shape of this uh, sinus. For, for that, I have a special mode, which is Airways, uh, that is here, and uh, where I can uh, uh, select negative, uh, so that means that uh, here you see uh, what uh, the, the Airways of uh, uh, the patient looks like. So uh, it's a sort of uh, inverse, uh, if, if it would be like the air would be solid. Uh, by the way, it enables you also to get a pretty good idea of, uh, of the anatomy of your patient. Uh, like this, if you look from the top, you see here all the airways in a very nice and detailed way. So let's uh, now isolate this uh, sinus. So for that it's quite uh, easy. Uh, I'm going to zoom a little bit and I'm going to frame the sinus using of course zoom when I can to make it more precise exactly um, and slowly but surely you will see that the shape of my sinus is going to appear that's a nice uh, sinus this one like this this, like this. There, there you go. We get our sinus. But of course, I could do here calculate volume. But at this point in time, is not yet. Uh, it wouldn't give me any good information. Uh, why? Because I, I would get simply uh, the uh, the volume of the full sinus, which is not the target that we want. Because we want to have the volume of the biomaterial. So let's define a level where we're going to put the biomaterial. Let's, let's say that in this inter intersection here it is going to be more or less the level. So I simply drop here the, the framing and uh, what we call a trimming and here I got. I still have a little bit uh, 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 of problem with this little fellow here. Uh, there, I think he's going to be disappearing. Right, exactly. So, there we go. If I want to be sure, I can simply add a little bit of definition, or in fact, uh, uh, I'm playing here with windowing. And um, next step is simply right click, volume calculation, calculate visible volume. And here you go, you get 3.2. CC uh, of uh, biomaterial. In case you just want to be sure, 
about what you're exactly uh, looking at. It's you have everything that is um, uh, in red is the the 2D volume that is calculated by, and you can see it clearly here in 3D. So that means that here we're sure that we not take into account this part. Of course, it's soft tissue, and and we define the windowing with uh, airways uh, for air. So we were looking. We say to the software, we are looking for air, and that's what he's calculating. So this was um, volume calculation dedicated for sinus uh, lift with white fox imaging.